Good afternoon, everyone. It's Robert from On My Turntable. Hope you're having a great afternoon. It is Friday afternoon. It's a coffee afternoon as well. <laughs> this is from Tim Hortons, the famous Tim Hortons, a Canadian coffee place, I guess, kind of like Dunkin' Donuts. I know there are some Tim Hortons in the States, but uh, there's one like a two minute walk from my work. So uh, picked one up on the way home from work. And uh, while I was at work on my lunch, I was watching this amazing um, bunch of guys talking about record collecting uh, on Jeff Witcher's Vinyl Destination channel. You had Chris Profi, you had Gary, you had Brandon, four amazing guys talking about uh, record collecting and record store day. And, and uh, uh, I was chuckling through most of it because yeah, I could see exactly what they were talking about. Um, why do we do what we do, basically, and uh, the reason for it. And um, it's hard to come up with an answer. But I'm going to attempt that. I'm going to add on to that feed, if that's okay with you guys, uh, which I've done up in the past with, uh, with, your guy, with your discussions. I like to add on to that. Uh, before I get into it, uh, I also won a contest recently. Uh, Boz, that final guy. I uh, want to find a $25 gift card from his uh, five-year VC, five year in the VC contest. So thank you, Boz. Um, and I immediately ordered this one from the Great Porcupine Tree, Fear of a Blank Planet. I love that cover. Um, I've kept the hype sticker as well on this one. Um, ordered it yesterday, it just arrived uh, before I got home from work. So uh, it was rated Animal of the Year from Classic Rock Awards 2007. Uh, dramatic, widescreen, exper uh, expertly executed, and uh, genuinely thrilling rock record. An aggressive modern merger of Russia's arena rock, UK Prague, uh, classicism, especially Pink Floyd and King Crimson, and the point grunge um, Vengeance of Tool. Just, and that's what Porcupine Tree is. It's all of the above. Uh, I love these guys. Uh, Stephen Wilson is a remarkable, remarkable um, producer, singer, songwriter, uh, all-around artist, and um, happy to have this one. Another thing I like about this one, Alex Lifeson does a guitar solo on the song uh, An uh, Anesthetize. Uh, Robert Fripp. Uh, does soundscapes uh, on, uh, on uh, the song Way Out of Here. John Wesley does some backing vocals. Um, yeah, cool stuff. And produced and arranged in, by Porcupine Tree and mixed and mastered by Stephen Wilson. Fear of a Blank Planet. Um, Porcupine Tree is amazing, amazing stuff. So this, the, the discussion. Um, these guys are, are, are uh, um, their collection is just outstanding. Uh, although, as as they were talking, I find Gary and myself are kind of closer, I guess, as far as uh, collecting. Uh, he started uh, really seriously a couple of years ago, two or three years ago. I was about three or four years ago. I was in a relationship before this, and I started to slowly collect, but nothing, nothing like I am today. And. Uh, um, Chris, of course, has thousands of, of uh, CDs and, and albums, and Brandon has um, an amazing collection. Jeff, as well, and, and uh, Gary. Uh, everyone's unique, as it should be. As it should be, everyone's collection is is remarkable. Even if it's a twenty five albums to or twenty five hundred albums, your your collection is your collection, and uh, cherish that collection for sure. So I was chuckling as I said, watching this because I knew exactly what they were talking about. <laughs> uh, is there a reason why we do it? I don't know. I don't know if there is or not. Um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a symptom, I guess. Um, and uh, it's a habit, it's a hobby, it's a passion. Um, it's uh, something... Um, in some ways, it's a bit of a drug because you're always wanting more, even though you've got 10 that you haven't even listened to or 100 that you haven't even listened to. 
and um, Brandon uh, is, uh, I guess, maybe the most organized in the bunch as far as how he wants his collection, which is cool. That's that's obviously his collection. He wants it the way he wants it, and that's how it should be. Um, he has purred some of his stuff, and um, and he wants his collection to be a certain state, which is fantastic. That's a, that's amazing. Uh, I'm more kind of like Gary as far as uh, I'm going to get it if I like it. Awesome. Uh, if it's not 100%, that's cool because it's just me listening to it. Um, and uh, I think I've got, I pick out a, a pretty good selection of stuff. But uh, why I do it, I, I don't know. <laughs> um, but uh, they were also talking about Record Store Day. Uh, I'm not a big participator in, oops, sorry, sorry guys. I'm not a big participant in Record Store Day A because um, locally we don't have much of a selection. Um, our stores seem to be out of stock or they didn't receive this or that. Um, and uh, luckily, the day or so later, it's available if it, if it shows up. So I'm not going to, I'm not, um, um, I don't pay much attention to what's, what's being offered or, or what's available or what's coming up. Um, A, because uh, you tend to, uh, anytime I have gone to record store days, it's a lot of money. And um, even though I like uh, buying albums, I still have to be careful of how I spend uh, my money. Uh, luckily, this didn't cost anything because it was a, a gift, um, but uh, um, the most my more recent purchases are, are wants because I've got a list of albums that I that I want to add to my collection. Uh, do I need them? No. Uh, will I listen to anything or everything? Sorry, everything that I have in my collection. Uh, eventually, <laughs> have I listened to everything recently? No. There's some albums that I've got in here that I haven't listened to in a while. Um, but I don't think I will purge them or get rid of them unless they're duplicates. I found a better copy of something or something like that. But uh, I think we do it. Uh, I think we do it for the love of music. Um, that's what I do it for. Uh, when I do videos showing what I picked up uh, or what I purchased or what I've discovered and found, it's not to brag or it's not to uh, say, oh, look what I found. It's to maybe show you guys some different bands that you may not be aware of and share those things with you. That's the idea of having this channel, is to share your music and your passion with other people. Um, I've picked up so much um, information about other bands and discovered other bands and newer bands to myself, even though they've been around for years, like Hawkwin. Uh, through watching other people in the BC uh, and hopefully I, I, I want to do the same. That's why I try and do that um, Great Bands You Need to Listen To series to help people discover new bands and artists and it ends up that people know about these bands anyway. A lot of them do, but there's some that don't. Oh, I'm going to check that out. And, and if you just get one person hooked on to a band that you love, that's, that's the whole idea of the thing. So uh, I just thought it was a great discussion. Um, <laughs> uh, I can't seem to stop, even though I've, I've, I, I've promised myself in the past, I'm going to slow down and, um, you get that bug inside you and, uh, you get kind of antsy. Um, and when I, when I dig, <clears throat> I, I, I don't go out looking for a particular album. Uh, um, I bring my Spotify playlist with me um, on my phone. If it's on Spotify, I'll check it out. And, I'll, and if I like it, I'll buy it. If it's not on Spotify, then I tend not to buy it because it's um, um, maybe not as popular as I, I think it should be. Or maybe it's just that rare that, that it's not on Spotify. Uh, so I, I, I dig a lot with uh, playing on Spotify. Um, or I'll take a mental note of something I found and hopefully it'll be there the next time I go back. Um, but uh, um, I, I just dig for that find. 
that gem that I'm going to find. Um, it may not be 100%. It may be a rare find. It may be uh, a little bit of ring wear on there, but the vinyl itself is great. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. Most of my collection is like that. Um, uh, but uh, it's just a fun thing to do. I enjoy it. That's part of the reason why I started this channel, to share music with you guys as you share music with me. Um, I'm never going to say uh, this music is terrible and you shouldn't be listening to this one or you should be listening to this one because this is the best genre ever. I will never do that because everyone has their own tastes. Um, and that's how it should be. You shouldn't say this music is the only thing you should listen to. Uh, there's a thousand different genres out there and everyone should be listening to uh, whatever genre they feel um, they love because it's their, they know what they love and that, that's how it should be. And that's the cool thing about music. If we all like the same music, it'd be boring as hell. No reason to have YouTube channels. <laughs> but watching uh, great guys like, the, like uh, Jeff and Brandon and Gary and Chris and uh, Aaron and, and so many others, um, these guys definitely know their music. They all have their likes and, 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 um, and uh, dislikes, but they're not going to be, uh, they're not uh, snobby about it. Um, and uh, I love all kinds of, all kinds of music. Now there's some music that I don't prefer um, and I just keep that to myself. Um, but uh, um, I encourage people to just get out and discover music. And that's, again, that's what this, this music, uh, that's what this channel is about. So as far as uh, <laughs> my uh, record collecting, um, yes, there are bands that I want to, uh, that I want to complete discographies on. Um, newer bands that I've discovered that have been around for a while. Uh, I've really gotten into bands like um, Marillion and uh, King Crimson and um, all kinds of uh, all kinds of stuff like that that uh, five years ago I would never have gotten into. Um, and there's so many progressive bands out there. Now I'm getting into Hawkwind which is a whole new adventure. Um, um, and uh, um, just, it's, it's, that's what you love about this channel and that's what you love about the, this music. And uh, again, um, get out there and have fun and dig. <laughs> and uh, I hope, um, uh, I hope you find what you're looking for and I hope you uh, love what you find and are happy with what you find. You don't have to find the most pristine thing in the world. Uh, you don't have to have a special turntable or the best turntable in the world. It's your music. You know what you're listening to. In my case, I'm the only one listening to it. So if it's got a couple of marks on it or a couple of scratches, oh well. Uh, I'm happy to find it and uh, I'll take care of it just as well as I would a a brand new album and I'll clean it and everything else. I'll baby it as much as I can and eventually I'll find a better copy of it down the road. Um, that's how I collect. Um, now of course uh, that's why um, a lot of these CDs and box sets that I'm that I'm recently getting are are more of a collector's item. Um, they're, they're a, a special thing to me. Uh, something again new. I, I, I was not a big box, uh, um, box set uh, kind of collector. But I'm starting to get there now, um, and uh, I enjoy doing that also. I just enjoy all kinds of music, and I've got so much music to listen to. Uh, there's probably albums in there that I haven't listened to uh, in a year or two, but I'll eventually get back to them and listen. Uh, maybe there's a contest going on, and I'll, and I'll discover, oh, geez, I haven't listened to this one in a while. Or I'll get through my, my uh, great band you need to listen to series, and I'll find a band that I haven't... Um, I haven't talked about in a long time or even ever and um, yeah, maybe people will like that and I'll, I'll do a, a, a video on that stuff so um, I like my collection it's not huge it's uh, enough for me <laughs> and it's just gonna keep on growing so anyway I hope that uh, uh, it was a fun 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 uh, chat to watch and I just wanted to add my my couple of cents in there anyway guys have yourself a wonderful day. Love you all. Take care.